So what's his name? Edward. Last name? Huh? Does he have a last name? Jones. If you've been paying attention, this man was featured in a recent caught misbehaving segment. And so you're burying your... My uncle. Uncle, he died of cancer. Yes. I ran to him in early 2019, the other day. and then again happened, several months man? later. Oh. What really caught my attention was the photo of the man he says is his uncle, Edward Jones. How long have you been doing funeral panhandling? Uh, well, this is not funeral panhandling. And he's correct. It's not funeral panhandling if there's a deceased person involved. Then it's called a fundraiser. How much money do you raise doing this? Um, I mean, we're being honest with each other. Right 50 now. to 100. Then he tells me he's not actually doing it for himself. My sister has a, she has a, a account from, uh, what's the name of that? Uh, GoFundMe. Okay. She has that account out. And she helps people that, that don't have any money for, funeral, for their own funeral. Seems like something out of a playbook for funeral panhandling. It's, it's, not, it's not a panhandling thing. It's not. Oh, it's to help random people. We just have random people. And so your aunt, yeah. your uncle, those are random people? No, well, if, yeah. Except for one small detail. The photo of his uncle is actually a Black Lives Matter activist who lives in Houston, Texas, who tweeted this statement. Wow, I don't know whether to laugh or be pissed. I'm a supporter of the homeless community here in Houston. However, don't use me to raise money. I am 35 years old. He is old enough to be my dad. Then he stuck with the lie. Now, I can't tell you what to do with your money, but one city has a great suggestion, and I agree. Stanley Roberts for Arizona's Family. Okay, Stanley's referring to the city of Scottsdale. It was back in May. They saw a rise in complaints from the public about these panhandlers. So they put up 20 of those signs at five intersections, discouraging people from giving money and encouraging them to instead give to charities. Now, if there is an issue that you want Stanley to look into, you can drop him a note at caughtmisbehaving at azfamily.com. You can also connect with him on Facebook or Twitter. We'll be right back.